You first. Hi, I'm Lou Taylor Pucci. And I'm Zoe Deschanel. And this, and is, this is Indie Wire, Wire on the Scene, scene at Park, Park City. City. <laughs> nice. <laughs> This is Brian Brooks coming to you from outside the Library Theater with today's IndieWire on the scene. Coming up, Annie Sundberg, the co-director of The Devil Came on Horseback, goes one-on-one -on -one with Ira Glass on his new gig at Showtime. We'll have our review of Chris Smith's The Pool, our latest in iPop. And now back to those two cutesters, Lou Taylor Pucci and Zoe Deschanel. Well, he steals my car. I stole is, her car. But then she rings me on the phone, and I'm, I'm like, hello. And, and I like, kind of start to know each other on this trip that I've taken yeah. her car on. And, but somehow uh, I let him steal my and car. You don't really know why, why that is, and I have no idea why that is. Mercer has no idea. But it's kind of interesting. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. Everybody really reacted well, and there was a lot of laughing, which is good. <laughs> that yeah. made me a lot happier about it. I'm going up to Winnipeg for it called Horseman, so that should be interesting because it's a thriller and it's kind of a bigger budget movie than I've ever done, so uh, it should be weird and new. I don't know. <laughs> Winterpeg. Winterpeg. What were some of the challenges of adapting This American Life to television? Like, should you see me at all as the person who hosts the show, or should I just be this like weird voice that you hear and never see? And ultimately, we rejected that because it seemed weirdly like artsy to just have a television show where you never see the host. That seemed really to defy all the logic of broadcasting. And at some point, <laughs> the director, Chris, came to me and he says, okay, What's the first thing that you get when you get at your own television show? You get a desk. Letterman's got a desk. Jon Stewart's got a desk. Leno's got a desk. We're going to give you a desk. But the thing is, we're going to take the desk and we're going to put it like everywhere. You're going to be in the wilderness. You're going to be on the salt flats in Utah. You're going to be on a mountain overlooking the mountains of Colorado. Like we're, and we're never going to comment on it. It's just going to be like, oh, like, look, there he is. How did it feel to show your face? I mean, you've been, you've been faceless. De dreadful. Horrible. Horrible. I don't recommend it to anybody. If anybody is watching, you're thinking, oh, I know, I'm going to go on television. Can I just say, like, particularly if you're over 40 years old, it's a really bad idea. You look into the camera and you're like, okay, I'm talking to you, I'm just saying this thing, I've got my six sentences I've got to get across, and you totally tell the audience. And then they go, yeah, you know what, like you sort of leaned your right shoulder forward, it looked a little weird, could you please just do it again? So you like, do it again, and you never thought like, oh, my right shoulder, like okay, so then you just like hold yourself sort of stiff, and you're like, okay, so I'm totally telling you this thing, and they go, you know, you're sort of leaning forward in this weird way, or like like the clouds came over, or, like a plane flew over the same thing, you do it again, so like 10, 10 takes later and like and, and then they're like okay th so that's the wide shot now let's go for the medium shot and now it's another 10 takes and now let's do the close-up and now it's another 10 takes and like honestly like I'm, I'm sorry a, but I'm it, a, it I'm kind of sounds I'm like he liked it I think he liked no, it I didn't know like I'm a civilian you know what I mean like I'm not a <laughs> professional actor I'm a civilian and like I only have so much sincerity inside me and so like I, I think he liked being on camera Hi, my name is Anthony Kaufman. I'll be reviewing The Pool, a dramatic competition film by director Chris Smith. Chris Smith has been to the Sundance Festival many times before with films like American Job and American Movie. With The Pool, uh, it seems natural in today's globalized economy that Smith would go to India to tell another story about work and the working class. The film follows a 18-year-old uh, boy who works in a hotel and sells bags on the street for extra money. Uh, and he, um, he takes uh, an interest in a, a, an upper-class home uh, not far from his work and the pool, the majestic pool that they have in, the, in, in their backyard. He ingratiates himself to the family. He ends up working for the man. And the story, uh, basically a very simple story, unfolds uh, with his relationship with this family. It's a really subtle, delicate film and refreshing, uh, the fact that it's in Hindi and, um, and that it's a really subtle, quiet story about, um, about class and about, um, about 
people giving to their fellow man. This is completely ridiculous to be saying out loud to a camera. IndieWire on the scene in Park City is sponsored by Fox Searchlight. This year, only one picture is an absolute winner. Five stars. Little Miss Sunshine is a piece of celluloid heaven that proves movie miracles do happen. Far out. So stand up and show your support. All right! for the little best picture of the year. Outstanding, soldier, outstanding! Little Miss Sunshine.